Hiding in the center of our Milky Way galaxy is a dark behemoth that defies our physics. Lying here behind thick curtains of interstellar gas, dust, and ice is a well of gravity exceeding the gravitational pull of over four million stars. Astronomers call it Sagittarius A star, a supermassive black hole. Traveling from our home to this deep, dark pit along the way, we pass by millions of stars, nebulae, and stellar nurseries. An intergalactic journey of some 26,700 light years. We are traveling to a very strange place. Once we've pierced the galactic center's veil, blocking most radiation from reaching us by looking in infrared light, we begin to see with new and sensitive instruments a view of our galactic center like we've never seen before. The first thing we see are the stars orbiting this gravitational beast. The close ones fly around in unstable orbits, while others gently flow in freefall. Some of these stars, and one in particular called S2, are getting very close to the black hole. S2 is orbiting Sag A star once every 16 years and at close approach is at a perilous distance of only 18 billion kilometers from the event horizon. At this distance, S2 is traveling greater than 25 million kilometers per hour. As amazing as watching these stars orbit Sag A star is, we can now look even closer. Using infrared telescopes never before brought to bear on this region and operated by the European Southern Observatory, we can also see something astonishing. Behind the orbiting stars lies a gas cloud, a stream of gas and dust, and it was captured falling into Sagittarius A star as it happened. For the first time, we can see a belt of gas falling into a black hole, live. Three flares were observed by the gravity and symphony instruments on the very large telescope in Chile. These three flares were infrared radiation given off as a blob of infalling gas trapped by the black hole fell in at over 30% the speed of light. What isn't clear is if these flares are one blob of gas seen three times or three different blobs of infalling material. The supermassive black hole lying at the center of the Milky Way is a very strange place. The gravity pull from Sag A star is unfathomable. As we get closer, the stronger the gravitational pull gets until a point of no return is reached. This is the event horizon. Beyond it, Newton, Einstein, quantum mechanics, all of it ceases to help us. These robust laws of nature no longer apply. Beyond the point of no return lies a singularity, a point of infinite density and zero volume. None of our tools equip us to help our understanding here. Does this mean that we can never know for certain what lies beyond the event horizon? <laughs>